It seems to me if the event's over by 10, then I can be back here at 11. Yes, sir. And you know what that means. Yes, sir. You could watch the girls' softball game. Did you just snicker when you said that? No, sir. Yes, you did. Mr. President. Thanks, Lou. When you said girls' softball game, you snickered. No, sir. Yes, you snickered, as if to indicate there was something wrong with my wanting to see a girls' softball game live via satellite. Well, you seem pretty excited about it, sir. They're ready for you, Mr. President. Thanks, Phil. I am excited about it. You come to the end of a long day, you sit back, you open a beer, you watch a sporting event. That's what men do. They watch girls' softball? When that's what's on, that's what they watch. It's that or a cricket match between Scotland and Bermuda. Now, I am an educated man, Charlie, but when somebody tries to explain cricket to me, all I want to do is hit him in the head with a teapot. Good morning, Mr. Good President. Good morning, Patty. So it's softball, Sacramento State versus the University of the Pacific. Well, that's a class of the Titans, Now, Mr. you're not going to spoil my fun. I wouldn't want to, I'm going to get to the end of the day. I'm going to sit back, open a beer. And watch girls softball. That's right. Good morning, Mr. President. Good morning, sir. Hey, Steve. Hey, Mikey. Listen, have I gotten any of the names right so far? No, sir, but you came damn close on a couple of them. OK, 